Welcome back. We are here on Ether looking at the uh, cryptocurrency market. This is going to be my daily forecast for Friday, October 23rd of 2020. And if you'd like to support our channel, you can welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. So uh, Bitcoin, we rallied all the way up towards uh, uh, for uh, 13,200 and uh, and uh, 24 and that was basically resistant at this point here over here and um, at this point we have a pullback so this pullback was completely anticipated due to the fact that we are significantly uh, overbought in bitcoin at this point we were above uh, 80 we're at 83 at some point uh, i mean and that is the basic sign that we are ready to pull back from here. We can also see that the stochastic has turned around. The MACD has not turned around yet, but it will do uh, uh, later on today or probably tomorrow. Um, but the CCI is also showing sign that this is overbought and we're about to turn around. So we most likely will see something uh, similar to uh, a fall, at least next uh, tomorrow of Bitcoin towards the 50 moving average. So we have been in an uptrend and we are still in an uptrend. Uh, there is a significant uh, support line here that will act as uh, support and will probably you know, fall towards this support area here and bounce. And that is the um, opportunity in order to enter this market for a buy. A break of this support uh, line and the 50 moving average opens the door to the 200 moving average and we, and has to be uh, said as well, there's a lot of uh, support underneath. Even though we break this, uh, we have this entire area here which will act as support. We can see how long we were within this area. Furthermore, underneath that we have this area here which also will be support so there's just a, basically a, a wall of support underneath we got our head of ourselves it will have a pullback and then we'll continue higher so if we break these highs then we go to um, significantly higher levels that we haven't seen for quite some time in bitcoin this may well be due to the uncertainty in the world of uh, in the world economy. Usually, uh, that uh, coincide that people invest in in in, in um, cryptocurrencies and also uh, in gold and silver. Uh, so that may well be the case. But no interest basically of selling this. I'm just waiting for this market to fall towards uh, support in order to enter for a buy. So Ethereum. So we have rallied again today. So this market has, this cryptocurrency has not rallied as much as Bitcoin has. So we have a lot of room to the upside. We can see that the, the RSI is not overbought. The technical indicators are looking really bearish, uh, bullish for this market. So we most likely uh, will not see major resistance until we get to this area here, 431 area. And then we'll go to these highs of 481. Um, a break down from here is not very likely uh, if you look at the technical indicators. Um, also due to the fact that we're not overbought. We're not over so we are basically right in the middle. So there's a lot of room to the upside. But a breakdown from here will find resistance support at the 50 moving average. A break below that we op opens the door for this entire area here at 334. And then of course the 200 moving average. Um, we are in an uptrend similar to uh, to Bitcoin, and uh, we have been in an uptrend since all the way back in March. So, um, yes, uh, cryptocurrencies are doing well at in this point, both for for Bitcoin and also for Ethereum. So, um, could probably enter the market. It is not really the best entry point. We could rally something similar to this. However, we could also fall back towards the 50 minute week average. I prefer trading when I see that we are going to have the second candlestick. Entry now is, is quite late for a buy. And therefore, I would at least wait until we have a pullback and then we see life and then we can go um, uh, trading that, uh, that growth. So 
Uh, hope you find this video helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by clicking the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button. That really helps our videos and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. So good luck and thank you very much. Thank you.